The Malawi School is a groundbreaking, radical project. It's built by architects in their own studios and workshops in Johannesburg, a whole school made into components and put into containers that get shipped to Malawi and unpacked. And not only do they use the contents of the containers, they use the containers as well. Uh, so we had this idea to, to make a kit of parts that we could um, pre-manufacture in South Africa and transport here and assemble here, but still involve local materials and local labor in Malawi, not just to bring an alien object. On top of this design and the system that is specifically designed for the project, there's also a level of community involvement. This building has almost become a symbol of identity to the community. With that, that high-tech feel of the building, we incorporated low-tech features such as the, the passive um, ventilation as well as natural lighting. We incorporated um, louver walls that could open, so you could completely open the classrooms, which um, helps with um, versatility of planning, so the classroom could actually extend into the passages immediately, but it also allows for even more natural light and natural ventilation. The roofs of the school, it's also two monopitch roofs equipped with gutters and um, a big water tank so they can also harvest water. It's, it's got a very low maintenance factor. My work has been simplified just because of the design of this school. Here in Malawi, uh, we rely most on education. And uh, we believe that when one has educated, he can develop the community and also the nation at large. It shows architects that they can reach beyond themselves, beyond their desks, beyond their computers, and really make a difference in society.